All right, this is a video response to Dummy Round, who asked, what is your favorite way to trim brass or prep brass? Uh, this is my preferred method. This is the, the Lyman Case Care Kit. Now, I do have a Lyman Universal trimmer right here, and I, I like this. It's easy to use, especially this quick chuck right here. Uh, the only problem I found is uh, when you're pushing pressure, putting pressure on this ram, it starts to uh, really affect your arm and elbow a lot. And I noticed that I was starting to get arm issues um, more than I already have because swinging hammers for a few years, I don't don't have really good feeling anymore in my arm. Um, I found this method to be a lot easier because I can put equal pressure on both sides. So I don't have those issues. Um, now, before with this setup, I would also have to use the old fashioned hand tools and these would cramp your hands up really, really good. Um, I mean, you sit there and you have to like, you know, peel your fingers away after a while. That was how bad that is. Uh, with this, everything is more subdued. Uh, you'll still get cramping and all that, but it's not as severe. Um, now what I'm talking about is these are the pilots that come with the, the case prep center. Uh, it basically uh, deburs chamfers, cleans the primer pocket, and even removes the crimp. Basically anything that you can attach into this little uh, standard screw you can put on there. So with that, this is the Lee uh, trimmers and the Lee adapter for a prep station. Now, by just screwing this in, I now have a prep station that doesn't require electricity. It's all metal. So if you also do this with that golf ball mod, it becomes very easy to size and trim without, you know, cramping hands up. Sorry. But yeah, this is my method. I, I can prefer this and got the idea from this. I picked this up at the local reloading shop. I forgot who made it. I think it's a uh, Foster, but this is one of their earlier, earlier versions. Basically, it simplified everything. It's just one of these mounted in there, and depending which way you have it in the chuck, that's the operation that it would do. So I really like this, and then when I found this, I knew I had to have it. So... Hope that helps. This is my preferred method.